Hey Toolerinos, this is the latest freebie I came across alongside the road. Troy built. Garden Way Manufacturing Incorporated. Troy, New York. It does actually still run, though not terribly well. Not sure if it has uh, issues, needs some tinkering with the valves or if it's just carburation or what, but it does run. It just doesn't sound good when it runs. And uh, it does go into gear and drive, so pretty neat find for free. Not sure what year this would be from. My guess is from the 70s. I haven't looked it up yet. It is a Tecumseh engine. So, pretty cool. I've seen guys uh, set these things up with, uh, they take the tines off the back and they put a little cart with two wheels and they attach it, you know, and they use the handles to steer and they drive it around at the shows and things. So, I don't know, I kind of want to keep it in the form of a rototiller, but we'll see. <laughs> we'll see what becomes of it eventually. Hey, Toolerinos. Here's an unexpected Easter tool haul. Uh, my parents came to visit for Easter from Pennsylvania, and they brought with them some tools that an acquaintance of theirs gave them to give to me. Um, this is a old oil can. Um opener and pouring spout. Uh, there's this old auto wrench that is a little bit unusual. It has very deep jaws uh, and kind of a weak top. It's, uh, it's a pit monster for sure. If it uh, is salvageable, it will not be a pretty uh, tool. So we'll see what we can do with that, if anything. But interesting. This is, you know, your typical old-style wrench. It's got a wooden handle. It's round, and it's all intact, and it works. But I have not been able to find any markings on it yet. I have not really cleaned it or anything, so hopefully there's some sort of markings. But it's in pretty good shape. And then this one here is uh, a different style that has the, the hex nut. And it's been used. It's been beaten. Um but the handle is gone. So, not quite sure what kind of handle would have been on that one. But, it makes it a fun, interesting project for the future, you know, where we can put whatever kind of handle we want on it, right? We can make a handle. And that'll make it unique and special and fun. Because that's what we want to do, right? Have fun! That's the point of all this. So, more freebies. Huzzah! Here's another freebie. Watch out a little bit. Picked this up on my way home from work. Just saw it in someone's trash. You know, my version of poor man's flea market. Uh, just to pick up stuff people put out for trash. And it's a tackle box. Uh, it's got some uh, Coleman lantern mantles, so that's cool. Various fishing things. As uh, my regular viewers know, I'm not really a fisher person. So, uh, I'm not sure what I will do with these things, but... I'm not sure if I'll keep this tackle box either. I might just uh, save these nice uh, organizer trays and use them for other things. The bottom three are empty, but there's stuff in this top one. And uh, it's probably not anything super valuable. But if we're just going to mess around with fishing, you know, that's good for us. So we're not ruining anything of value, right? Maybe someday, Big Vic. Maybe someday we'll get out and go fishing. Alright, later.